Army, we're we're a family, and today we all have to just pull together and kill. This golden day is ours. I'm surprised Milka's brain doesn't go invisible when I get close to it. Everything's on fire. We're all gonna burn. What are you doing out here, Gloria? I can't remember the last time I came out here at night. It's so beautiful, isn't it? These plants could use a little water, though. Now where's that hose? What's up, Linda? Prepare yourself for passage, human child. Uh. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Kraler? Let's go 
could afford... I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble Psycho Master. radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Why can't everyone be so helpful? Yeah, I modified the antenna so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Oh man. So, any questions? Is Elton okay? Well, he'll be fully brained soon, I promise. When he comes out, tell him I'm waiting for him down by the docks, okay? Hey, do you want to help us save the... Typical. That's why finding your brain in particular was my highest priority. You know, I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. No, actually I think her mind's on other things at the moment. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. Agent Cruller? What is the current situation? I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Kruller? It's time to go to the lake. Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. What's up, Linda? Prepare yourself for passage, human child. Greetings, Dr. Lobotta. Up to the secret laboratory, then, is it? One moment. You're not Dr. Lobotto. My eyes may be half gone, but I would recognize the mad doctor anywhere. He's got a stone-cold face a man doesn't easily forget. He wears a beastly smock covered in thick straps like an electric chair. And in the place where his hand should be, there's nothing but a gleaming metal claw. So if I'm not mistaken, you're not Dr. Roboto, you don't pay my salary, so kindly back away from my elevator and die. Thank you, sir. Where'd everybody go? Is everybody dead? Excuse Behind me, you, sir? General? My name is Napoleon Bonaparte. Oh, uh, excuse me. Mr. Bonaparte. Shh, 
I only think I'm Napoleon Bonaparte. Do not listen to the weakling. He denies his lineage because he feels it. I like your jacket. Very strappy. You want it? You can have it. Just help me undo these buckles in the back and all. Can... What are you doing? The uniform of this army is sacred. We shall wear it proudly until the battle is over. Help me. Ah, oh, good. Move, mate. <laughs> Sacre bleu! I have been hit! Can't get a good grip. Can't get a good grip. found my super valuable rare coin. Yeah. Can I have it? Knock yourself out. I got enough memories of my dumb ancestors hanging around. Uh. Hey, I found this rare coin in the fire. Oh, that's where it was. Well, you can have it. Last thing I want is another family heirloom. Who's winning? Nobody's winning! Want to know who's losing? The Bonaparte family name! Look, I forfeit, okay? You win. Napoleon Bonaparte wins again. Is that the real Napoleon Bonaparte? I mean, the imaginary real Napoleon Bonaparte? Yeah, I'm actually related to him. Can you believe it? Shut up! Stop telling people that simple fact. I don't even want to be here. But when this sad excuse for a Bonaparte lost a simple game of war to a feeble-minded invalid, I just could not take it anymore. I was forced to take control, and I will stay in control until I beat the love of victory into this degenerate swan who dares to call himself a Bonaparte. No, really, great-great-great-grandpa Napoleon, I do love victory, like, a ton. I love it so much, you can go now, I swear. Your move! Who's winning now? Who do you think? Who's winning now? <laughs> no. I wish my own descendants had your fighting instinct. Who's winning now? <laughs> What's this? My lazy opponent is actually trying to win? He has sent in reinforcements. Well, well. Then let the game truly begin. Send in my best soldier. You! Destroy that bridge! For France! For France! I hate your stupid bridge. This is how much I hate you! 
Ha <laughs> ha! Suck on that bridge! Ah, yes. Now I shall go torment this poor peasant over here. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, man, now look. The bridge is broken and I can't move my pieces past it anymore. I quit. Napoleon, you win. No! We don't forfeit. We're gonna beat you, Mr. Genetic Memory of Napoleon Bonaparte. Ha <laughs> I like your je ne sais quoi, your joie de vivre. Maybe you will teach my long-legged nincompoop a lesson, eh? <laughs> Alors... Excuse me, Mr. Bonaparte, but how do you play this game? Ah, this game is so easy, even a child like you can play it. All my worthless descendant has to do is move a knight piece into the center of my stronghold. Ha <laughs> ha! But his knight isn't even on the board. He's hiding out in that house. Well, maybe he's got a good reason. And knights are good at storming strongholds, but they are no good at field combat. So he'll also need a strong militia to fight my soldiers. But he has no militia! These people are hiding out in their houses, hopeless, hungry, and unarmed. Yeah, but... And if they came out to form a strong militia, they wouldn't be able to move around the board because I keep breaking his bridges. Hey, that part is your fault. He could easily fix the bridges I keep breaking if he just had a carpenter. But his carpenter is hiding out in his house! <laughs> Afraid. Well, war is scary. So you see, it is an easy game, but Fred has already lost it. Not this time. This time, we're going to win. No, we're not. Fred, shut up. into your footsteps on my roof all night trying to break in. Why don't you just slide down the chimney? I got a nice fire going for you in here, Mr. Burglar. Okay, if I'm a burglar, then how can I be down here talking to you and up on the roof at the same time? Maybe you're a ventriloquist. Listen, if I go see what's up on your roof and take care of it, will you come out and help fight Napoleon? No. <laughs> Maybe. Good enough. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hello, I'm recruiting for the army of Fred Bonaparte and... Go away! Fred Bonaparte has forgotten the people, and we have forgotten him! What? Fred loves the people. He was just telling me that some of his best friends are, um, the people. He has abandoned us. He doesn't care if we live or die. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll talk to Fred. I'll talk to him, and I'll prove to you that he cares about the common man, and that the fight is not meaningless. I'll believe it when I hear it from him. It's a duffel bag tag. some wood to work on, and I'll go to town.
a good grip. Can't get a good grip. Bugging you? Yes. I should give this to that guy who I should give this to that guy who'll fight for I should give this to that guy who'll fight for money. to serve the cause. So be it. Yeah. 
If it is truly a time of war, then we are ready. We can no longer pull our heads into our shells and hide. We are, after all, armored warriors, and this is our land too. We may not be fast, but we always march upon the glittering path of righteousness, for we created ourselves from our hearts. Lead us onward, and let us eat holes in the leaves of Napoleon's garden. Wow. Right on. Yes. fight for money. Can't storm Napoleon's stronghold today. Too weak. Oh, okay. Want me to call a doctor? No, I'm not sick. I just can't find any decent food around here. An army moves on its stomach, you know. An elite force such as I require an elite cuisine, I'm afraid. Oh, well, I'll keep on the lookout for some place with good takeout. Only the best, young lad. I am a Frenchman. And anything but the finest French delicacy might bruise my palate and leave me unable to storm anything, save the vomitorium.
How about you fix that broken bridge over there? How about you fly me over there? My legs seem to be glued onto this base, which is kind of weird. Oh, now who went and broke my beautiful bridge? Don't worry, darling. We'll get you fixed up good as new in no time. Man, I am good. Mm. Bugging you? Yes. Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Get a good grip. This rare coin in the fire. Oh. Hey, I found this rare coin in the fire. Oh, that's where it was. Well, you can have it. Last thing I. Hey, Fred. The problem is, people think you don't care. What? I care? Then lead them to victory, Milkitust. Shut up. They think you don't care if they live or die. What do they want from me? A notice on my official stationery that says I'd be sad if they died? Yep. Huh. Well, if that doesn't work... Let me guess. You give up? 
Bingo! Ha! Another game at which I would surely defeat you. Hey, you take that little victory if you need it, tiny man.